Blaine Police's second in command stepped away after close to 40 years with the city. City leaders past and present paid tribute to him in special ways. Deputy Chief Dan Sikulski stood by last week as Blaine leaders wished him well on his retirement and reflected on a career that started so long ago. Back in the day when we had a cattle crossing on Main Street in the morning, we would shut Main Street down and the cattle would move from the south to the north and in the afternoon we'd move them back. We wouldn't move them, but we would block the traffic for them. So as the city has grown, um, it, it, it's just been great. The city hired him in 1984 as a reserve officer, and he served in nearly every division since then. The paths that I have crossed with everybody, I've taken something from those meetings, and it's made me the person I am. It's made me treat people the way I treat people, um, and it just, everything that I do and the decisions I've made because of all of those friendships and however our uh, paths have crossed in life. It's a life of service to the people of Blaine, no matter the reason they called 911. People don't know who else to call, so you've gone on broken hot water heaters and whatever, and you're just there to, to help people the best you can and give them some advice. And he will remember fondly the bonds he forged within the ranks at City Hall. The people here have always been a family, and if there's a legacy from now, from way back when, it was that Everybody just cared about each other, and as we grew, uh, that grew. As it culminated with Dan front and center, as so many said thank you and job well done. It was just really an honor, um, really heartfelt. It took me back. After a vacation to Florida, Dan said he expects to spend as much time as he can at his lake house and by volunteering where and when he can. Blaine Police promoted Dan Pelkey as the new deputy chief. Pelkey was a captain for a while and is the city's emergency manager.